I want to go way, way back, back, back a long time ago, back all the way to the year 1980. I remember that. When a movie named Airplane was released. Now, Airplane was a funny movie. It took an established hit like the airport series and poked fun at it in so many different ridiculous ways it became a real classic. But ever since then, they've been trying to rip off Airplane, and Police Academy is the latest dismal failure. This movie is bad. <laughs> it's the story of a bunch of misfits who are in training to be police officers, and it starts off by showing us what misfits they are. Here's a scene with Steve Gutenberg as a car hiker who's ripe for the Academy. What the hell's going on here, hud? This rude little punk won't park my car. Barney, park this car. Spangoli, take a look. If you can find us, do it now! Or you're fired. Understand? Fired. Fired? That's not fair. The guy has a bad attitude. What? Do it. Okay, I want you to apologize to this man, then park his car. Yes, sir. Sorry. Get out of here. And clean the ashtray while you're at it. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry, Lou. You just can't get good help these days. They don't respect for anything. They don't respect the customers. They don't respect property. They don't respect respect. I mean, my kid. It fits! Without... Once they're inside the academy, the trainees attend a karate class. I need a volunteer. Barbara, get out here. I, I just ate. Right where I'm standing. Right here. Right now. All right, now. Come at me with an imaginary knife. Do I have to? Yes, you do. I'm not joking. Come on. Come on. No! Okay, that's how it's done. Who's next? That's me. I love it. I love it. Now those two scenes are kind of, sort of funny. But believe me, they're the high points of this very low movie. Police Academy has an uncanny ability to miss the punchline in joke after joke. There are scenes in this movie that are so pointless, it's not just that they're not funny, we can't even figure out why they're in the film. What is this doing here? When is it that it isn't funny? We don't know. Another thing, the movie allegedly takes place in the United States, but this Police Academy is like no American Police Academy I've ever heard of. It's a 14-week boarding school. Maybe they meant to call it Military Academy and they changed their mind. I think that's because it was shot in Toronto and uh, so that there's this whole Canadian sensibility to what's going on there. It isn't like any police academy I've ever heard of either. Mm -hmm. I want to quote back to you the line that you used a little earlier in evaluating this film. This movie is bad. That it's was, shockingly uh, bad. <laughs> <laughs> they cut away from what's funny frequently. Those jokes at least mm -hmm. paid off. The mm -hmm. tilted car, everyone raising their hand. But more often than not, Mm -hmm. Just when this film is building up ahead of steam, they cut away from the mm -hmm. joke. I couldn't get it. It's there, stunning. There were a couple of scenes in the movie where somebody walks on screen and says something, somebody else yes. comes in, and a situation is set up for a joke. And then end. End. Yeah. No payoff, no failed joke. Yeah. Just, it's over. And you say, what was that? It went by and it never came back this again. This is as much of an imitation of Private Benjamin as it is of uh, Airplane, actually, and it's no way in that class. You're right. Quoted thumbs down on Police Academy, one of the most inept and idiotic comedies in a long time. And two 